Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and this is a quick look at the battery usage on laptops in Windows 11 because it is of a very detailed nature and it's really nice to have that happening. So in Windows 10 we have battery usage information that is very limited compared to here. Um, here you have graphics, you have all sorts of things that will show you what apps are using the power and um, you know how much time you use your laptop on battery and so on within either the last 24 hours or last week. How do you get there? Quite easy. Simply right click on your start button and go into the power options. It will immediately bring you to the power and battery. So you have a graph, a detailed information about the usage of your battery. You can uh, check out the detailed information for the last 24 hours if you want. Um, last seven days you'll see that there's a little dent right here because here is where I used my laptop on battery a little bit. Um, when you look at this you will have information specific about all the power usage. What is using the most battery? on your device. So by looking at this you'll know what exactly is being the battery hog basically. Now as you see here system which is the Windows system is the biggest user of battery but you will see that you know depending on what you use some apps might use more power than others depending on what you do on your computer. You also have uh, the information on how to set things. For example, the screen and sleep information is here. If you need to uh, check out, you know, do when do my uh, screen is uh, going off or not, and what do I do? So, on battery battery power here it says turn off my screen after ten minutes. When plugged in, turn off my screen after. I'll actually put never. In this case, uh, I don't. I don't like when my screen turns off. Um, so this is okay for my um, plugged in power. Battery power, put my device to sleep after. So maybe I could put like an hour. And here in battery uh, power, um, so one hour. And when plugged in, my put my device to sleep after never. So uh, on battery power, turn off my screen after 10 minutes. When plugged in, never. So this is perfect for me. Now one of the things that the um, that you could see is there's balanced mode that you can use actually all sorts of power modes. Now this is unavailable when on certain power modes. But when you are here, you can actually see and here there's a support for that. but you'll see that you have options available if you optimize it correctly. I'm always using my PC on high power usage basically on making sure that it's performance uh, and rather than you know having different other options. You have the battery saver that you can turn on or off which is battery saver. Uh, turn the battery saver uh, automatically at right now is never and of course lower the screen brightness when using battery saver which means that the screen will, of course, dim. Screen is the number one battery usage in, in, in a computer, pretty much. And of course, keep an eye on the apps that are down here. There's not, not much you can do about system, depending on what you do, but there's definitely something you can do about the other apps. If you see that system is 50% and I don't know, uh, there's an app that you're using all the time that's at 40%. That means maybe that app is actually a battery hog. So you got to be careful. But the very detailed information is fun because it really, really shows you everything about your battery levels and battery usage um, on your laptop uh, every day and in the last week if you want. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.